Oh, you have no idea the treat that you're in for. It's my Chanel ready to wear dresses collection coming up right now. I think I've been wanting to do this video for like over a year now and I got a couple new Chanel pieces that I wanted to show you. So this is the perfect time. I asked you guys if you'd love to see a Chanel ready to wear collection. A lot of you said you definitely wanted to see it. Today we're just going to be doing dresses. I'm going to show you all my Chanel dresses and you're gonna want to stick around to the end. There are three Chanel dresses out of 11 that I'm selling. I'll be posting them on my Instagram, so stop what you're doing and follow me right now at StyleHard on Instagram because I will be selling a few of these dresses. So if you love finding hot designer fashion at discounted prices, follow me there. Now I wanna tell you, I love my outfit today. Since we're doing a Chanel ready to wear dress collection today, I decided to wear a Chanel brooch with my gorgeous blouse and today's video is brought to you by Lily Silk. And I gotta tell you, I love my outfit today. We're in 2022. There is nothing more me than this blouse right now. I'm serious, this is so cool. And I find it kind of edgy and super classic at the same time because it's a little bit loose and oversized, not too oversized though. So I can rock it very street style, like how I'm wearing it today, just like untucked, relaxed, cool, fashionable, but then I can also wear it really sophisticated and chic, really contemporary, really classy, and I love that about Lily Silk. I've worked with Lily Silk at least three times before. We love long partnerships on this channel because I love working with brands that I actually really love because that's the only kind of brands you're ever gonna see me work with. And of course we love that Lily Silk is environmentally friendly and they focus so much on having zero waste from luxurious silk bedding, pillowcases, blouses, dresses, pants, gorgeous fashion across the board. This is a luxury premium brand for non-premium prices. These are truly luxurious investment but affordable pieces, affordable luxury sign me up. And Lily Silk has been in the game for several years now. They have 12 years of experience in silk manufacturing, expertise, designing, and manufacturing. I am a Lily Silk kind of girl. I'll rock a Lily Silk pajama, and then I'll rock a Lily Silk button down. And this is something I could style in countless ways. Like even as I'm talking to you now, I'm thinking about how I could style this. Like I could just wear leggings with this and belt it. Like a beautiful belt and like nice, beautiful leggings. Like I'm not talking Lulu's, I'm talking like a crisp pair of black cotton leggings, you know, with this oversized silk belt it or rock it with a skirt, very corporate or, you know, heading to a bar mitzvah, heading to a ladies brunch. The options are endless. The black flowy pants for me are such a vibe. And this is so my style. I'm gonna tell you already, you're gonna see me wearing this in the summer with a tight tank top and cute Hermes sandals. You know, it's so easy to wear, comfortable. It's like you're in sweatpants, but you're in really chic, beautiful, fashionable pants, right? Like flowy, loose fitting, very on trend and very expensive looking. But then also with a pair of high heels and like a beautiful blouse like this, like you're suddenly fancy. Day to night, so easy, just like that. It's great as a gift also. Like you actually cannot go wrong with a Lily Silk gift because let's say you don't know what someone's personal style is, you definitely can't get it wrong with like pajamas or a robe or silk bedding, especially if you care about your skin and your hair. Now you guys know if I'm gonna put you on to a brand like this, I'm gonna hit you up with a discount code because your fashion mom cares about her kids. So make sure you check out all the links in the description box, use my discount code to get yourself a discount on these gorgeous Lily Silk pieces. Now let's get into all the Chanel, shall we? I know you guys wanna see this and I wanna give you what you want. It's been a long time coming. I think it's the perfect time. It's Chanel. Let's jump right in. Now for the Chanel video, I gotta start strong with my favorite dress out of this collection, but actually my favorite dress in my entire wardrobe. I absolutely die. I die for this Chanel dress. I just can't even tell you guys how much I love it. I love everything about it. It gives me very Margot Robbie in Wolf of Wall Street, like just such a vibe. It gives me Sharon Stone in Casino, which is my favorite movie 
of all time. Of all time. And, you know, I don't even know if this is Sharon Stone's aesthetic in that movie. Probably not, but it just gives me the vibe. Sometimes it's just a vibe, you know? It doesn't have to be, doesn't have to be so precise, but it's a vibe and this is, this is just giving me Sharon Stone, Margot Robbie. It is so cool and so young and so youthful, but also very, very Chanel. And listen, the two don't always go hand in hand. I love Chanel. A lot of Chanel ready to wear does have like young youthful elements to it, but for the most part as a fashion house, it is more mature, a lot of mature style dresses, which I'm going to show you throughout this video, but this one is not. It's I love the colors. I love the style. Of course, uh, you can see it's very short. I love that too. I did have it shortened because this is a nightlife dress. You know what I mean? This is not something that I would wear on a day-to-day. -day. It's a night out on the town. It's date night. It's girls night. It's everything, but you know, nighttime. Not so much daytime. Love, love, love this dress so, so much. Next, we have this absolutely spectacular black knit with like gold weaving and gold buttons. Now this dress, I just love so, so much. But when I filmed this video for you guys, I realized like this dress isn't doing that much for my body. Like I think it's really cute and it looks good, but there are some dresses that look better. Like I think it's not really like sucking me in and slurping me up the way I like. Uh, definitely, this is something I need Spanx with. I wasn't wearing Spanx for the video, but I think I would need Spanx for this dress. I truly, truly love it. I was considering selling it, but actually my editor, she's like, you cannot sell that. It's such a beautiful dress. So I was like, okay, maybe I won't. And it really is. It's so beautiful. It's so classically Chanel without being too classic. I mean, it's classic, but it's not, right? Um, it's just, it's a black dress, but it's not a plain black dress. It's It's got beautiful detailing to it. The sparkly gold threading throughout the quilting, like it's like just like a beautiful, quilted knit. It's just so, so stunning. So while I absolutely love, love, love the dress and the look of the dress and the style of the dress, I don't know if it's the best for my body, uh, but I really, really do love it. All these sizes, by the way, are size 34 for the most part. Sometimes I'm a 36 in Chanel, but for the most part, I'm a 34. And then we have this Chanel beautiful logo knit, which actually is a size 36, but I did have it taken in a little bit in the waist. Um, just because like I said with Chanel, it's a little bit mature and so the cuts and the styles are often mature too. Most Chanel dresses and ready to wear isn't like sexy and tight fitting. It's usually kind of just like straight down. Um, so I like to alter the pieces to complement and flatter my body. So that's what I did with this. I love this style. I love it with the white sunglasses. It's very resort, very cruise like this is just such a cute vacation piece and just like great for summer. It's logo-y with the CCs all over it, but I, I feel like it's done in a tasteful, classy way, which Chanel usually does. I've never seen, well, I've seen some tacky Chanel pieces, but for the most part, even when they have logo, it's still pretty classy. And this is just one of those pieces. I love this dress. I think I'm going to have it forever. Dress it up, dress it down. Such a good one. Now, if I were to rank my Chanel dresses, I would say this would be maybe in third place. Actually, this might be fourth place. I love this dress. I love it. I don't even know. Saying that this is in fourth place is still giving this a very top rating because I, I love all my Chanel dresses. I love this dress so much. It's a cream off-white knit. It is beautiful. I just wore it this past Christmas holiday in Florida when I was in Miami with my family. And this is what I love so much about this dress. It's casual, but also very, very classy and very kind of fancy, like with heels and a beautiful bag, this could look very fancy, right? With like a slicked bun, beautiful earrings, maybe studs, maybe like Chanel earrings, like the pearly kind of Chanel earrings. This could look nighttime, it could look fancy, it could look going out, but you could also wear this with a pair of flats or a pair of Oran Hermes sandals like I mentioned earlier. You know, super classy going about town, but you know, not trying too hard. It's one of those pieces that's just effortless and super classy. I love this dress so much. 
Next, we have this super stunning saucy number that you can't really tell on camera, but it's pretty see-through. So this is one of those times that Chanel really did put out a very, very sexy collection, sexy dress, because this is just one of those pieces that is just very, very sexy and it's very short. Yes, I did have it shortened because when I go out, first of all, I'm only 5'2", five 5'2 two, five two to be exact. So um, to make a dress short, I mean, if it's the style is supposed to be short, like how it's shown on the runway, I always have to shorten them because I don't have those legs on a 5'10 body. I'm 5'2 and a half. So, you know, to get that look, I gotta shorten them. And yes, this was shortened and it's very sexy. Again, this is so stunning with a very slicked bun and like maybe a hoop earring, like what I'm wearing or something pearly or something silvery. It's just beautiful. It's young, it's youthful, it's sexy, it's stunning. It's Chanel. This is just beautiful form fitting to my body. And what I also love about this is that I can wear this in any season because although it is see-through, if I wear this with a pair of dark opaque tights, it kind of looks like the dress is lined. I could wear a little black camisole underneath or even if I really want to do this in a winter look, I mean, we're in spring, summer, but if I wanted to do a winter look, I could do dark opaque tights and then a super skin tight black turtleneck with this. How stunning would that be? I gotta style these in the winter so when we get into fall winter you guys remind me that you want to see my Chanel dresses styled for winter because out of all of these there are quite a few that I could style for fall winter and of course spring summer and this is one of them. A turtleneck and tights with this. Stunning. Slicked bun. Oh so good. So good. All right, now you guys, okay, I filmed this video and I am so mad at myself that I forgot to show you guys the newest to my collection, this strapless tweed vibrant colorful dress. Now, just like I said with the last black dress I showed you, that was made to be sexy, to be young and youthful, just like this. I did not have this shortened. This is how the dress is stunning. I mean, tight, short, stylish, sexy, but like not too sexy, right? Like, you know, when I go out at night, I love to wear something a little sexy. And when I say sexy, I don't mean raunchy. I don't mean scantily clad. Sexy, stylish, fashionable. I love it. I love feeling feminine and, you know, taking advantage of the beautiful fashion that I have in my closet. So while I can, I will. This is not going anywhere. This just fits me like a glove. I didn't film it, but if you're following me on Instagram, you may have seen me try it on in the change room because I showed you guys several Instagram story slides of me in this dress. And yes, now you know I bought it. And if you don't follow me, make sure you follow me. I promise you, I will show you some video footage of this dress and definitely some photos. Now this gorgeous beauty right here, I don't know if I mentioned that that colorful tweed is my second favorite. Um, maybe it's tied with this one. This is definitely my second or close third. It's a close third fave because I love this dress. I bought this dress recently. This is current season. I absolutely love it. It's a cream color, the most gorgeous gold buttons, not just any gold buttons, but like a muted, shiny, very soft gold, just pure sophistication. Um, with the little CCs on it, just subtle, you know, subtle, like you can't really see that it's Chanel unless you're kind of close up and looking, um, which I love about it because it's, it's very Chanel, but not in your face. It's so beautiful. And again, so sophisticated because I just love when fashion meets sophistication. I just do. And for me, I mean, I feel like Chanel really encompasses all of that. It's got this tie, you can wear it open, you can tie it up in a bow. I think the shape is beautiful. This one is a size 36. And actually when I bought this, I bought this in Miami on a recent trip and they didn't have any 34s and I thought it fit me beautifully. So I'm always definitely between a 34 and a 36 when it comes to Chanel, just beautiful. All right, now with this dress, you might notice off the bat that this is a vintage dress, especially by looking at the tag, the Chanel tags. 
don't really look like this anymore. This is a very old tag. I don't know how old this dress is. I imagine it's from the 90s. I think it's just really, really cool. And I bought it vintage. Obviously, I didn't buy it in the 90s. I didn't even know what Chanel was in the 90s. Here's the thing. This dress I bought with the intentions of like having it altered and taken in. I never got around to doing it. I've never actually worn it, which is stupid. I'll admit, like I don't like buying things that I don't wear. And look, this dress does not really look good on me. Let's be real. It looks very like it's too mature. It's matronly. Is that even the right word? It's frumpy. It's not good on my body. It's too long for my frame. So it's just not the vibe I feel like this dress. But I was kind of thinking instead of having it taken in, just kind of like hold on to it for a while. Because I really feel like, <laughs> I know I'm saying that it's frumpy and not attractive, but I kind of feel like this is a style that could come back into style and I could kind of learn how to style it for my body a little better. So I'm kind of on the fence whether I have it taken in or leave it as is. It's cute, it's very vintage looking. It does not look good with the hairband. I don't know what I was thinking doing that so bad but yeah it's just like one of those pieces that is vintage it's like a piece and it's something i kind of just want to hold on to and not touch what size is this even does it even say it's so old they used to like type it i swear to god with like a typewriter oh it says it's a 38 that's weird because this looks more like a 42 on me like it's just so huge and oversized but Maybe that's how the sizes were back then. Not for me in this moment, but definitely like a cool vintage piece to have. And now the moment you guys have been waiting for, the dresses that I'm selling that I will be posting on my Instagram. Now, I think every single one of these, if I think too long and hard about, I change my mind. So I decided I'm gonna sell them, I'm just gonna stick with it. But every time I look at them and, you know, even when I was filming this video, I was like, oh, should I, shouldn't I? Um, but I decided I'm going to. I don't think I need this many Chanel dresses. I just think, you know, share the love, you know? Let's start with this gorgeous navy blue and off-white knit Chanel sleeveless dress. It's got little CC Chanel's all over the dress, like five rows of CC's. It's so cute. The design of the knit, the diamond pattern, and the CC's, which you can't see, from a distance that you're at, but you can see in photos and you can see obviously in person, the CCs, so, so cute and a beautiful, beautiful cut. Now this is a size 34. I would say it fits like a small or extra small. It's not a super, super tight 34. Like a 34 in a Gucci, I can hardly zip up. Like I can't really do a 34 in a Gucci, but in a Chanel, a 34 is looser, more forgiving, plus it's stretchy. If you're a zero, a size two, or a four, you are comfortably fitting in this. I think a size six would be a little too tight. Love it, but yes, decided to sell it. Beautiful. Next, we have this knit dress in a size 38, but definitely fits like a size 36, I'd say. It fits like a small. This could definitely fit up to a size six, but it really is beautiful, very classic Chanel with the logo Chanel buttons on the pockets of the skirt of the dress. And it still has the tag on. This has never been worn. It's just a beautiful, beautiful piece. I actually bought this from a designer consignment boutique in Toronto. I loved it. I tried it on, it was beautiful and it was new with tags. I was like, oh, I'm gonna get a brand new Chanel dress. But the truth of the matter is that I have not worn it. So I decided I'm going to sell it it's beautiful and beautiful on the body. Very classic and very classic Chanel. I really do love this, but again, I have not worn it, so I decided I am going to sell it. Size 38, knit stretch Chanel. And last but most certainly not least, I am also selling this gorgeous black Chanel tweed. Also, I've been on the fence about selling this for a solid year. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. It's gonna be a yes, because again, I haven't worn it. Maybe it's because my lifestyle has not allowed me to wear these things. I always think like, am I gonna regret this? I hope I don't. But the thing about this dress is that 
also can be styled for fall, winter, and of course spring, summer. It's all season. You rock this with black tights and again a black turtleneck. How stunning and chic. This is black tweed. This is the most coveted out of all Chanel dresses, the black tweed. It's funny, I told my friend I was gonna sell this. She said this was the one I could not sell because it's a black Chanel tweed. It's got gorgeous detailing in it. It's a size 36, which is about a small extra small, very classic. I mean, it does not get more LBD classic black dress than this and you know, it is Chanel. I really do love it. I love all these Chanel dresses, but when you gotta downsize, you gotta just stick with the plan, you know? So that wraps up my entire Chanel dress ready to wear video. Now I have to do a part two because I have the dress that I didn't show you guys on. So I have to show you guys in detail how that dress looks on, okay? And I also have a lot of other Chanel pieces to show you. I have a few skirts and a few tops, but I didn't think that I should include skirts and tops in this video because then it just gets too much, right? We're just doing Chanel dresses today. Um, I could do other cute Chanel outfits and then I could do a separate video for like, Chanel sweaters and jackets. And it's not like I have that much Chanel out of all the Chanel pieces that I have in my closet. I definitely have the most of the dresses. That's why I thought it was worthy enough to do a whole video. But I definitely do have some other notable and beautiful Chanel pieces that you might have seen me wearing here and there on Instagram, on TikTok. So they are worth showing you guys in a follow-up video. So we might have to do a part two. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you leave me a comment down below. Let me know what dress you loved the most, and also let me know what you'd like to see from me more of in the future, any video topics you'd like me to cover. I love hearing from you guys. A lot of you guys give me really great ideas. I'd love to hear from you. So make sure you tell me what you wanna see. I love you guys so much, and I can't wait to see you in my next video. So until next time, bye.